The word blockchain probably makes you think of cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin, but blockchain can be used for a lot more than that. In fact, we just used it in our governance elections. The blockchain that Bitcoin is built on top of is really only built uh, to keep track of account balances, more or less. Uh, so Bitcoin itself wouldn't really be a good fit for an election because it's not flexible enough. But Ethereum, the technology that we used for this project, lets you build more or less whatever you want while still guaranteeing that uh, kind of immutability where you can't go back and change previous data. We chose to pilot the blockchain technology in our elections this year because it was a relatively simple application that still had a robust enough solution for us to actually put into use and potentially for other credit unions to use. What we were looking for with the new voting system was a simpler and more efficient way for our members to be authenticated. We already asked members to authenticate when logging into things like personal online banking, so we were looking at a way that we could incorporate that and eliminate that secondary authentication. For the election portion, uh, it's giving the members a better way to vote without having to go through the hassle of keeping track of another set of sign-in credentials for the voting process. For the credit union as a whole, it'll let us better spend the members' money when we're making decisions on IT infrastructure. The new voting system and the blockchain technology was successful in our election this year. It did enable us to increase voter turnout, and it also set the stage for us to make uh, even further changes to improve the member experience. So the credit union election process has historically been very traditional, and when members' banking behaviors change, and as we evolve in how we do our banking, we also need to evolve how we are engaging our members in our democratic process. Technology and banking are constantly evolving, and so are we. Putting blockchain to use for our elections is just one more example.